When it comes to planning your wedding day menu, few chefs know how to serve up eco-friendly fare like the immensely talented and world-renowned Wolfgang Pack. It's really our philosophy for our future is, you know, to take care of the environment, to take care of pollution, hopefully. So if we get ingredients which are grown closely to us, there is less gasoline use, so it's better for the environment. And I think every little step helps a little bit. One of Wolfgang's green ideas is adding a twist to such locally grown food, complementing a wedding's location and enhancing the guest's experience. If we are in the south, obviously people want more southern food, so we use the local ingredients, but then we change it to our style. We can make grits maybe and then add maybe some truffles to it or add some wild mushrooms to it, whatever people have there, so it would be a little different. Wolfgang understands that guests have different tastes. If that extends to fish, he says you can still be eco-friendly. Sustainable fish is probably one of the most important things these days because we all know the oceans get overfished and then all of a sudden one species disappears. There's so many fishes out there now which are not endangered and you can use that. Some of the dishes which are always in demand are really like our classics, like our smoked salmon pizza for appetizer to be passed around with champagne. It's the perfect, perfect dish. So I'm gonna show you how we make it. It's really easy. We use the pizza dough here, just stretch the dough a little bit. Now let's put some olive oil on here and a few red onions. We put that in the oven and bake it for about five minutes. Now that the dough is ready, we're gonna spread a little dill cream here on top. You can use a little creme fraiche, a little sour cream, some dill, a little lemon. And here we have our home smoked salmon. We'll make it ourselves, that's the best way. Here we have some sturgeon caviar from the Sacramento Delta. We don't use sturgeon from the Caspian Sea really because a lot of the species are endangered. And a few chives, easy and simple, huh? A little smoked salmon and caviar makes a good beginning. From fish to fresh fruit, for Wolfgang, getting great green ingredients means getting to know his suppliers. That's really the most important thing. You know where they get the ingredients from, where they get, raise the or farm the vegetable, raise the uh, animals. We never would use veal, which is in a cage, or chicken from a cage, or, or pork or pigs raised in cages, so everything has to be free range. For example, we have a farmer up in uh, Sonoma who raises lamb for us. For main course, I love our Shino Arakov lamb. The lamb really comes from Sonoma, so it's free-ranging lamb, so it's the perfect quality, and also it gives it a little thing to it, a little spice to it. I have a little soy sauce, a little bit of honey, some chili flakes. We want the bride and the groom to be happy and excited. We'll crush a few garlic cloves in there a little bit of ginger, and a little bit of green onions here. Marinated in the refrigerator for about three hours. Now the lamb is enough marinated, we're gonna drench our lamb in a little oil, and we put it on here. That way it gives it a good smoky taste also. So we sear it well on both sides. We're gonna put it in a pan and in the oven. We're gonna cook our rack of lamb for about 15 minutes and then let it rest for at least 15 minutes. So here you have it. This is a perfect wedding dish for me. You know, it has a lot of flavor, but also it looks beautiful. Wolfgang knows buying organic means adding to the taste of your food and dollars to your budget. Many times, you know, buying organic vegetables and uh, free range chicken or veal is more expensive, so that just comes with it. But I really believe it's well worth it. And at the end of the evening, as Wolfgang told us, going organic will get you and your caterer all the applause you can imagine. To me, the best part of a wedding is when they sent me a note the next day or two weeks later when they come from the honeymoon. They said, you know, the wedding, everything was great, but the best part was the dinner. <laughs>